Hmm. It's red wing blackbird season. The city has apparently had complaints, so this is how they are going to help people avoid getting attacked. They've put these signs up in a few of the parks down along the water where the uh, rather protective little birds are. They have a tendency to uh, come at you. Now, one expert says, be patient. They're doing it for a good cause. Remember, they're not doing anything more than you or I would do. If someone walked in your front door that you didn't know and went up to your children, you'd say, hey, get away from there. And that's all the male red-winged blackbird is doing. He's saying, back off. And if you just walk away or sit on the bench across the path or take the, the sidewalk across the street, uh, he's not going to bother you anymore. I've rarely seen or heard of anyone being injured from it. It can be a little bit surprising, uh, but I think if you step back and understand that the same life force in the red-winged blackbirds is in each and every one of us and that we enjoy nature in the city and they're just protecting their own from what they see as a threat, you can actually enjoy it and not feel like it, it's a negative experience. Price says there are hundreds of birds protecting their young. They'll be around from now until the end of June. As for the city, it says the signs went up after getting some complaints. They were overwhelmed from scared pedestrians. Now, they might need to place a few more places to get the attention of those walking by. Do you think the signs will help, though? Do they make a difference? Uh, no, I think people are look, probably looking at their phones and looking at the beautiful water and flowers rather than the signs. Yeah. You're familiar with this guy? I, I am. He's he's my, my friend for hitting the top of my head. He's just reminding me that I'm uh, invading his territory. Are, are the signs helping back there? They <laughs> warn you he's attacking? No, I mean, he, they're everywhere. All right, to... Uh... Avoid having an interaction with the birds. Maybe keep your dog on a leash if you have your dog, says Price as well. You can change the other side of the street. Wear a hat if you're concerned. And if you see one of these signs, maybe avoid it. It's probably a good sign right there.